Hey guys, MGH here and welcome back to my Bradford City career mode. But unfortunately, I'm going to have to start off with some bad news again. This career mode is bugged. It's constantly freezing. I've had... How many career modes have I done now? I think this is my fifth I've done on FIFA 13 and I haven't had any issues before. I had one on my Real Madrid career mode, which obviously I didn't upload to YouTube anyway. Only uh, like live stream highlights. Um, but I've never had freezing problems, and then this happens. Now, this season, I'm about a couple of games in. You're seeing gameplay with um, with a couple of games that I've got, um, where it has it, it's just been freezing. Like, I, I just I get to a certain point of a match, and the game freezes. And that, even if I sim it, it freezes. So I'm having real issues. I've managed to get past it, and you're going to see in a couple of minutes, we're going to cut to some live commentary. Um, but if you follow me on Twitter, you'll know that I have been struggling, to be honest, guys, with this bloody career mode so far. Just been nothing but problems. And uh, also, just wanted to mention about my Twitter. A lot of people thought I was hacked yesterday because my name changed. Um, but it's not. My my new Twitter name is at OfficialMGH. It's, it's actually me. And uh, all I did was change my name. Anyone can change their name on Twitter, by the way. You just go into your settings and you can change your handle. Um, and I, yes, uh, MGH PS3 Gaming HD has gone. I, I'm trying to completely disassociate PlayStation 3 Gaming HD with my name now. So if you want to follow me over on Twitter, it is at official MGH. Link in the description. But yeah, guys, I'm going to try and power on. Um, I don't want to stop this career mode necessarily, but if it if it keeps freezing, there's going to be problems because it's just it's so depressing trying to make a series when it just constantly goes back you know you, keep, you, you make two steps and go back three you know it's a real disappointing thing to have I can't, I can't believe we're still even mentioning these freezing issues on this game when it's been out for eight months it's absolutely ridiculous but what can we say it's EA and they don't they can't be bothered to fix it uh, another word is oh this is the point where it froze by the way so basically in game it would just freeze and I, I would go into the like the main menu like this and I couldn't move. I couldn't move the menu at all. So I tried turning off my controller, turning it back on again. And literally right now, I was flicking it left and right. I just could not get back into the game. It completely froze. So uh, unfortunately, I had to, I lost a lot of games there. But we're going to cut to the live came, uh, live commentary now, guys. Like I said, I'm going to try and power through this and not let it bug me. But we'll see how it goes. See ya. Okay, guys. So as you know, I had a bit of a problem with freezing uh, twice now. It's uh, extremely frustrating, but I'm not going to go on about it now. Um, we're just going to try and crack on with this. I might sound a little bit different. I've actually recorded the last bit before this bit. And uh, it's the morning and I'm always a bit more uh, hay feverish in the morning, if you know what I mean. But anyway, something just happened a minute ago. But first, I, actually, I really should show you the uh, results so far. So despite the gameplay that you've just seen, um, I've had to play these matches again, obviously. And it's very, very frustrating. Uh, we started off with that 2 all. That stayed the same. And uh, the 1-0 against Bury. That's where it froze and I lost everything else. We then drew two all there, two all there, and we are here. So, at the moment, I think that, yeah, we're 13th. We're unbeaten so far, three games, three points. That's in the league anyway. We've got one win away in the uh, Capital One Cup as well. So, really not too bad. Um, let's just hope it doesn't freeze again. If it freezes again, guys, um, and if, if it like does it again on the same point, I, just, I don't know what I'm going to do. I just I have a feeling that this could be like a bugged career mode, you know? Uh, luckily for me, I haven't had any career modes before this with this problem, so I guess, like I said on Twitter recently, I think this was coming. <laughs> it was eventually going to happen to me. Um, but anyway, if I go into my squad really quick, you're not going to believe what happened just a second ago. Uh, you'll see there's one player missing. Gosling's sitting there. Who who was there before? That's right, Samosa. I got an offer of 950000 and I was like, yep, I'm taking that, but my recording software wasn't on. So I am sorry, guys, I haven't got that bit of recording. It's been a real kerfuffle, this career mode so far. It really has. It's been nothing but problems. I have actually considered stopping and just doing a new one, but I don't know. You guys let me know what you think I should do. Um, yeah, whatever. But there we go. Samoza has gone, and I've got 800,000 to spend from 950. They took 150k from it. So uh, I thought I'm going to plow that into the team, buy a really good CDM. And this time, I saw your comments. You guys were like, oh, why are you being so cheap? Just give them the money. You're right. You are so right. I'm really like, I'm like that in real life, guys. I'm really cheap when it comes to trying to buy uh, players. I don't want to spend much money. I, I want to keep it as, you know, as low as possible. But really, I shouldn't be doing that. So what we're going to do is midfield, center midfield. Uh, minimum attribute level, I want at least a 65, maximum of 75, because look, I've got 1.4 million to spend now. That is why I sold Samoza. He's not that good, right? 
to get that kind of money for him is brilliant. Uh, we want max estimate estimation worth. We'll go for a million, and max wage ten thousand. That should bring up some nice players um, that I should be able to afford. Actually, I've had to change it to five hundred thousand and five thousand a week just because the players that popped up. They were just that little bit too expensive. I don't want to blow the full million on one player. I'd rather get two with this money. Um, so let's see who we can get. If we go up age first. There's Linganzi still. I'm, I still reckon I should go for him. Yeah. Let's see if we can get it. Approach to buy again. Honestly, they're going to be sick of seeing my emails. Um, I think we can get 350 there. Let's, let's see if that straight offer will just work. 750 a week for him would be an absolute steal. It really would. Um, I'm thinking of getting a centre-back as well. Um, yes, I think a centre-back would be better. Let's go ahead and see if we can find one. A uh, minimum of 65 again and a maximum of 75. I think that should do nicely. Just someone to strengthen up that defence, you know, and see if we can get anyone that's at least <laughs> with a, maybe an 80 potential or so. Um, but get, then again, I'm not using those websites in this career mode, guys, like most people didn't want me to. Because uh, it is a little, it's a little bit cheating, you know. You know which players are good or not. Um, I would like a guy with a bit more pace than 49. I'm not going to go full pace whore, you know. Mid 60s is fine. Um, this guy here is it Moises? He's got a high defensive. He can play as right back. Now that could be pretty nice. Um, okay, let's keep going down here. We got Mvoto there. Should I go for Mvoto? This guy is an absolute beast, isn't he? Damn, look at that. Six foot four and he's just an absolute giant and he runs fast as well. He runs fast, guys. I think this guy was probably the best choice, if I'm honest. Um, and it looks like he's got he's got less than a year remaining, so I might be able to get him cheap. Um, let, let's just go for a 300,000 and see what they say. And then I think I'm going to leave these two offers on the table just so... Um, if I, if I do make the sale, then I can see how much I've got left. Sorry, not the sale, the purchase. See how much I've got left and then use that remaining money to possibly buy another midfielder or even a defender. Akron have come back once again saying that he is too valuable to them. So again, I think obviously they need him. Okay, but if I offer a much more pricey tag, then I might just get away with it. So let's bump it up. Let's go 550. Um, or I could even add a player maybe. Let's see if I've got anyone I could potentially add to this. We've got Hepworth, uh, Monacana. See, he could be decent, but he's 22. He should be higher than that. All right, all right. We'll go for Monacana and drop that down to 450. Let's see if that will persuade them. Because then at least they're getting a replacement, you know. That's what they need, someone to play there. It's quite simple, really. And uh, transfer offer accepted for Moises. Uh, I'm probably saying that wrong, so correct me if I am. 3,000 a week. It's quite a lot of money, that, for a centre-back. Um, but... Let's see if we can just get him for that. Right, so we've got a home match against Notts County now. This is an absolute must win just to get myself some points on the board. Let's go ahead and check that my team aren't absolutely exhausted. Um, because I have had three draws so far. All 2-2. All two, two. So I would like to get some points on the board right now. Um, we need a different C um, Let's go for Monacana then. Let's give him a go. Um, but this team looks pretty strong. I'm happy with that. Again, we've still got Hines and Wells up front with Reed on the left, Ramizi on the right, and Aradai in the middle. It's a very strong forward. Lots of pace there. Lots of great agility. Um, people able to run past uh, the uh, opponents pretty easily. So let's see how we get on here. Um, and what the fuck? I just realised I spent like 20 minutes the other day do doing the squad numbers, like giving Tonkin number one. And it hasn't saved because it froze. And I do know now that Tonkin, the goalkeeper, has a potential of at least 90, which is so, so, so lucky. I'm so happy with that.